What's up guys and welcome back to another day of Whitley Auto Works. Today we're jumping right back into our Rust-Oleum Custom Mix Series with the awesome new spray out. I've got Gloss Black Rust-Oleum and I've got Apple Red Rust-Oleum 2X. Got my fender prepped up behind me. What we usually do is we two-tone it. We shoot a cool new pearl over top of it that you guys request and want to see and we discuss it and we rate it. One, you don't really care for it. Five, it's the greatest thing you've ever seen and rate it anywhere in between, guys. Anything goes as far as your opinions and everything on this channel, that's what it's all about. We're gonna love it, we're gonna hate it, but hey, we're gonna get through it and do it together. Either way, guys, the pearl I'm putting over top of gloss black and gloss red today is an interesting one. It's one of the chameleon pearls out of my sample kit called Olive. So from what I've learned so far from it, it's supposed to shift from silver to green. And I had a subscriber want to see a silver pearl over top of red, so I thought this would be a great opportunity to shoot that out and try out some crazy new combinations. So, like I said, we're going two tone this fender behind me, red and gloss uh, black, and hey, then we're going to shoot a crazy pearl and see what kind of effect we can get. So let's get into today's video. So we got our apple red and our gloss black down on our fender. I am going to be using the Speedo Coat Clear today. If you've seen the past episode, you know that uh, I reviewed it and it's a really good quality clear. So moving forward on the channel, I'm going to try to use it as much as possible. Might switch it up, but for the foreseeable future, this is what we're using. Anyways, I got four ounces of my test clear mixed up. I got an ounce of hardener. It mixes four to one. It's about 70 degrees today. So this is medium temp hardener. And we're going to mix this cool new olive pearl over top of that Rust-Oleum mix. Um, this is supposed to shift from silver to green. Uh, <laughs> it, my, we actually used a bottle of this on my wife's Galaxy roof. Uh, if you haven't seen that video, that was pretty cool. We took a bunch of pearls and just threw them all over the top of her roof and did a whole big like Galaxy thing, like a pearl bomb type deal. Really cool video. If you haven't, go back and watch it. But yeah, um, so I'm gonna spritz a little bit of this in the mix. It's a five gram container. I'm not going for any certain pigment load, just trying not to overload it. But uh, these color shift pearls can be kind of forgiven sometimes. So I'm gonna spritz some of it in there. That should be good enough. And I'm gonna get to mixing this real quick. And I'll bring you guys in close so you can see the mix. Alrighty, so this is a white particle based pearl, so it's going to be a little bit difficult to see in the mix. Almost looks a lot like the gold interference pearl, but I got a feeling when we put this down on the panel, it ain't going to. It's going to do more color shift stuff. But this is the mix, guys. Let's get our paint gun loaded up and let's get spraying. Alright, guys, so I got my pearl mix loaded up in my old Vivor gun, 1.4 tip. I shoot a 28 psi wide open trigger if you want to replicate my settings. And I'm going to put my mask on. We're going to do a light coat first just to introduce the pearls to the rust and make sure we don't get no reactions. And we'll move forward and I'll show you guys the results.
All right, guys, so this is a spray out for today. Gloss black and apple red with an olive color shift pearl over top of it. Now, I tried not to overload the mix on this one because I know I have on previous videos. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say it. I really thought this was the silver to green color shift one. Uh, obviously with the name Olive, I think it turned out to be the more of the yellow to green color shift one. There is another one in the set named Mint that will shift from silver to green and you'll probably see that on a future video. But anyways guys, I actually think it turned out pretty cool today. I'm not upset, but ultimately it's not up to me. It's up to you guys. Rate it. One, you don't care for it. Five, it's the greatest thing you've ever seen and anywhere in between. If you want to buy any of the products you saw me use on today's video, the clear coat, the pearls, the paint gun, any of it, guys, links in the description, as seen on YouTube, click that, it takes you to my Amazon storefront, and you can purchase anything there. And it goes to help out the channel with a small kickback, but it doesn't cost you guys anything extra. Well, that's going to be it for me today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you made it this far, hit that subscribe button, drop me a like and comment. I'm John from Whitley Auto Works. I hope you guys have a great day. God bless. And I'll see you guys on the next spray out.